This is a quick how-to to make a self-soldering butt splice. I'm gonna show you a really quick and easy way to connect two wires together. We're gonna to strip the ends of these. Then we're gonna fan out just the wires a little bit so that we can make a mechanical connection between them before we add our special connector that I'm gonna add next. So I strip them and now I'm just twisting to get a nice tight little connection there. And now that I have that in place, I'm gonna take one of these connectors that has solder right in the middle of it, as well as the heat shrink to keep it nice and watertight. I'm just gonna slide it down right over that connection that I made. And now we're gonna hit it with the heat gun and we're gonna look at how that actually bonds with the wires under the microscope. All right, I'm gonna situate this guy right here, clamp it down so it can't move. And there we can see our solder right in the middle of those wires. Now for this, I'm gonna use this heat adjustable Porter cable heat gun. I can make it a little less intense, but I'm gonna go full hot. We are gonna solder this connection down right now by giving it some heat. Now, truth be told, I've used these things a few times and I wasn't doing that mechanical twist and the results were not nearly as good as this was. Okay, now we're gonna check our connection, make sure that it is nice and strong, that that solder has gone between all the strands of wire there and it has indeed, it is a nice, strong connection all because of this little connector. Now, just like everything else, I just show you my experience and I've done a couple of these now with that little mechanical twist. It's worked out a lot better. Let me know if you've used these things before and how they worked out for you.